hey, hey, peeps, it's your girl, I Candy, and I have been out in these streets today. Whew, I am worn out. <laughs> Let me tell you. So I'm here, I got retail, and some of this stuff has been ordered online, and some I just went and, and bought. I went to Walmart, I went to the Dollar Tree, and I went to, um, is it the Family Dollar, Dollar General one? So let me start with this. This is a package came in. I ordered this about a month or two ago from Wish. And it finally came in. I showed you uh, a few days ago, I showed you the earrings. Remember this, uh, this ship wheel and um, the anchor. And I was a little disappointed because the, um, the stems on them were bent. <clears throat> so... Um, I can get it out. This is the bracelet. And it's one of those multi-pieces. And it's got the steering, um, steering wheel again. It's got an anchor. And this says courage. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but it says courage. So this is just, uh, it's blue. The ba uh, band is blue and white, navy blue and white. So that's that. And let me go ahead and open this because I think this is what it goes with. Again, this is Wish. So that was like a couple of dollars. Okay. Oh, yeah. This is what it goes with. Hope it fits. Now, this is Wish, so it's Chinese-based, so I went up to a 2XL on this to make this my size. So, this is the skirt, 2XL, so yeah, I should be able to do something with that. It's stretchy, so yeah, it looks, yeah, it's been folded up. Pretty sheer, I can see through it, so it's pretty sheer, but that's okay. That's the skirt, and then this is the top. And again, this is a 2XL, so this fits, it'll be kind of big. I don't want it to be tight on me, so I think this is going to work for me. So, when you that's the thing when you're shopping from um, China, even though um, you know. It says extra large, small, medium, large. You got to check their measurements and you need to make sure the measurements are in um, inches or you need to make sure you're using the centimeter side of the tape. You don't want to confuse if it says 46 centimeters and you're looking at 46 inches. That's that's some difference. OK, but yeah, I'm looking forward. I got that and I got the skirt. Now I got the earrings and the neck uh, bracelet. I don't think I, I didn't do a necklace because of the pattern on the dress. That was like maybe $17 for the set roughly. Okay. Um, also online, <clears throat> if you follow me on Facebook, you hear me talking all the time about how, how when I go walking, um, I'm still experiencing pain. And I kind of think I know what that is. I think I have a pinched nerve, but I'm not 100% sure. And at this point, I'm unable to go to the doctor because I do not have insurance. So I've just kind of walked until I can't walk, and then I stop. But I'm not going to let that pain stop me from walking. So I saw these on television. Yeah, I went for the as seen on TV. And I got two of them for $19.99, so $10 a pair. <clears throat> They say they have uh, shea butter, coconut oil, aloe vera, vitamin E. They're supposed to be easy on and easy off. And they're supposed to have, um, here, they're supposed to have arch support, ankle support, and footbed support. So that's where I have my problems in the, the footbed and the ankle mostly and the arch. So we'll see how they work. 
These are the, the copper fit, <clears throat> excuse me. They're just black, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, not, not the cutest thing. I, I have seen some cuter compression socks, but I don't know if they had as much going on for them as these. So we're going to see how these work. I don't mind wearing black. Yeah, so that's that. Okay, as I said, I've been out in the streets here today. And um, one of the places, I'm just grabbing bags that are, are close to me so they won't necessarily be in store order. So the first one here is Walmart. Um, I have a hummingbird feeder on my deck. I had two. <clears throat> one wasn't so good and it kept leaking all the water out. And uh, the last storm we had, it got blown over and I threw it away. Well, I've got two females and two males. I thought I had one female and two males, <clears throat> but I think there's two females and two males. The one female has become territorial and will not allow any of the other hummingbirds to drink from the feeder. So I was looking up and it said, when you have a bully hummingbird, yes, a little, little bitty old bully hummingbird, <laughs> Um, well, the, the suggestion that's going to work for me is that you get additional feeders. So she will keep her, she, that will be her feeder. So she'll fight anybody that comes to that. The others will have a chance at this one. I got this one and this is glass. I had seen it, been eyeballing it and it was like $25. And so when I went back today, <clears throat> excuse me, it was on sale for, um, was it $14? It was either 14 or 16. So I went ahead and got this one. And then I have a plastic one that's like a um, rectangle or, yeah, rectangle. It's plastic. This is glass. It's a rectangle. And then it's got like a little twist kind of to the middle. So it looks kind of art deco or modern artish, you know. So I've already put that one outside. And um, we'll see. How, we'll see how things go when we have more feeders for everybody so everyone can feel welcome. Okay. Uh, Dollar Tree, I told you I went to Dollar Tree. Um, I don't know if y'all can see them or not, but that table right there, I had those red flowers from uh, a couple of Christmases ago and I just stuck them in that vase, in that vase because they look so pretty. But as you can see, my uh, my colors are blue and gray. So I found these today at the Dollar Tree. It's got these are the darker blue, and then these are the lighter blue. This these are iris. This is a peony. This one is a rose. Thing is in the way. This one's a rose, and let me see what is this one. another iris and another iris so one two three irises a peony and a rose and i only got two of the peony rose the dark ones because this one is so bunchy so i'm gonna change those out so that they match oh, cause, although that pop of red was kind of cute but <laughs> okay oh Also at the Dollar Tree, hey, <laughs> uh, I was out of my, uh, what do you call it, baggies and such. So I got the hefty uh, trial pack of quart size. These are stand and fill. Then I got uh, these aluminum foil sheets. Um, there's 30 of them in here. And it's just a little sheet, just a little bit bigger than this here thing that you could use like to cover. I use it for my uh, toaster oven pan at the bottom. Okay, I'm running real low on foil. So I got some of their foil. I got the, the smaller is 25 square feet versus the other one has 
40 something because I think this is a, a better grade of foil than that other kind that's real like paper thin tissuey. Okay, I got some uh, gallon size freezer bags. Um, I didn't have none, I ran out of all of this. And then I got some sandwich bags with the Ziploc on them as well. So, my little drawer was empty. Uh, I got another bottle of Dawn. I like to keep uh, stocked up one or two of those. And um, my spatula, what happened to that spatula? I had a all plastic spatula and it, I don't know if it melted. I forget what happened to it. Maybe it got cruddy and I just didn't like it anymore. But anyway, so I got this one from the Dollar Tree. It, Mm, yeah, it's gonna it's not gonna last too long. I got another one from Walmart, but that one ain't gonna last too long. Then if you'll notice my hands, I got polish on my first fingers only. These are some peel uh stick and peel polishes. And um I got them. I didn't bring the ladies information with me. There was an ad on Facebook for some um, gel nails that you peel, you know, you just peeled them on and stuck them on, and it's just the polish. And so um, I was asking about removing them. Well, because they're gel, you have to remove them like gel nails, which um, right now I'm trying to avoid the gel and all of that because my nails had really got messed up. So the lady inbox me and she's like hey I've got some that you remove with regular nail polish if you want to try them and so um I was like okay she said I could try them for free so I was like okay and so she stuck them in the mail it was just a cup these two you know it wasn't the full hand or anything and so far I like them and you know I have to do my hair uh my only issue I'm dealing with right now is this nail is broke and it's broken down in there where I can't cut it off and be okay. So that's one reason why the hair is still like just in a bunny tail. But y'all yeah, know I'm not working. So I don't have anybody to impress but myself and you guys. And I feel like I can be me with you guys. Okay. Um, and then speaking of nails, I decided I got some polish. This is number 913 doesn't have a, a name Oops. it doesn't have a, a name just the 913 it's kind of a mauvey purplish like uh it's coming across kind of pink and it does have some pinks in it so i thought it would look good with the this nail it look may look gold to you but it's got some pinkish hues to it as well so i got that and then i got some um uh, top coat rapid dry so I'm not going to say what day because as soon as I say, if I say, I'm going to do my nails today. So, but I will be doing my nails. Oh, I got some plastic wrap from Dollar Tree also. I told you I was out of all of that stuff. Okay. Uh, next, oh, I went to the Pottery Barn. Uh, looking for a table for outdoors because, you know, I have a big pick, uh, patio table, but it's at, on the patio below and it needs to be painted and it's sitting there and there looking janky and I just, it's just too hot. I ain't felt like fooling with it. So I sit outside in my chair, but I need a little table. So I went to, uh, well, I tried to look at Target. I tried looking at Dollar General and Family Dollar. They're all out of those little metal tables they usually have. So today I said, let me go to the old time bar, to the Pottery Barn. And um, I found me a little table. I'll show you in a second. But I also found this. No drinking during, no working during drinking hours. So... This was $9.99 at the Old Time Pottery. Um, I haven't been there in a long time because their prices are just too much, <laughs> too much. So, um, 
I want to pause you because I want to go get my table. And I think this. Okay, y'all, sorry about that. I went outside to get my table, and it wasn't outside. It was actually, I did bring it in, in the kitchen. I tell you, I'm just whirling today. My mail lady caught me, and she likes to talk, so. Whew, okay. Um, where was I at? Where was I at? Okay, I showed y'all. Well, I showed y'all all of that stuff. Well, let me just go ahead and pull this table over here. To show y'all, this is the little table. They only came in this color. Not my favorite color, but um, it was $6.99 or $7.99 at Old Time Pottery. And I had that out there on the patio. Just sit my, when I sit out there and I drink my coffee, I'll just sit that on there. Okay, let me keep it moving here. Okay. Wally World. Wally World, they hardly ever have stuff on clearance like anymore when I go through there. And so today they had some tops. Normally $12.96. And I got two of them. They were on sale for $3 each. And uh, I think I got some shorts, kind of that color with flowers. And then this one's navy, or is it black? It's either navy or black, I can't see. I, I got the natural light going. I got the lights on, but anyway, it's cloudy today. So I think that's navy. Let me see if it says on there. Sometimes it'll say. No, but the both of those are no boundaries. She just, the mail lady just brought me another package, y'all. Oh, this is just some food. I got some corn chips at the Dollar Tree. And I got some ranch dressing. Gonna make me some ranch. And I got me some gummy bears. So, yeah, that's all I have for this round, guys. But I do, this was all uh, retail stuff. I do have another haul, and it's going to be um, stuff that I got from online thriftage. And uh, I think I may have a couple or at least one package over there from Amazon where I ordered some stuff. So, okay, check in in a little bit. Deuces.